Renfrew, former ICW heavyweight champion. Last time we saw him here at North Wrestling, he was stabbing skewers into the head of Clint Maguera in a Texas death tag team match. Slightly different setup tonight. Yeah, this will be more violent. Scotland's finest Buckfast on show here at yeah. North Wrestling. Yeah, again, for those not familiar, uh, yeah, Buckfast is very Scottish and very, very regretful. So here we go. It is a best of five. I mean, let's look through some of the history of the great best of fives in Ooh, wrestling. Renfrew getting a cheeky pre one. Book it's a pre workout. Book Booker T versus name redacted from WCW. John they Cena drink versus. Drink vodka and Buckfast in WCW. I have missed that. John Cena, Randy Orton. Good best of five. Now it's vodka versus Buckfast. Uh, North Wrestling. This is exactly what I wanted to see when I was a kid in wrestling. Oh, just ten stuff. So Boris going first. They person become bartender for this. He's dressed like one. You know what? He's, he's, he's done that deliberately, I'm sure of it. First shot, administered. Very successful with the first shot. Vodka is drowned. Vodka is down. Red Blue's tail. Vodka is down. The bookie is very down. Things could be quiet, please, to distract me, wrestlers. You sound like a darts commentator. I'm letting you do this. I'm just, I'm just kidding. I'm at, I'm at the bar. Second round. Boris with the vodka. Boris with the book fast. Renfrew with the vodka. Renfrew with the bookie. Third one. Renfrew with concern. Oh, cross down. Dual wielding by John Wood. Join at home if you like. Fourth round. Happy Dexterous. Renfrew finishes the vodka. Finish is the bookie. And we're out. If you press your red button now, you can watch The Ascension drinking whiskey. 888, you've got some time. What do we do here? The vodka's been down. Fucking madness. You're now watching Weatherspoons on a Saturday night at 11.30. Oh, no! Oh, no! Oh, 
no. No! Oh, oh God. That's gonna cause an international incident. And this was going so well. This is how World War Three starts. And here we go, part two of the drinking contest. Now we've got a match. Oh, these sorry bastards are going to wrestle after all that. This is like chucking out time at Weatherspoons. Well, I don't think it's just going very long. Just a distinct lack of bouncers and a home to go to. Boris and Chris Renfrew, now one on one, loaded with vodka and wreck the hoose juice. Boris, a beautiful running knee in the corner, putting Renfrew on the outside. Chris Renfrew may be running to the loo. It just looks like that buck fast might make a return. Oh, God. oh my God! <laughs> the drunkest trophy you'll ever see. A tope suicida from a battered, drunk Russian. And Renfrew now raking the eyes of Boris Kozlov. Oh, big chop. If Renfrew can hit those sober, straight, or the wide. I mean, this is a real showcase of the true wrestling ability of Chris Renfrew and Boris Kozlov. You try drinking a bottle of vodka, followed by a bottle of Buckfast, and then you try tying your own shoelaces, let alone wrestle a match against either a Russian with a, with a massive chip on his shoulder or a Scotsman with an arguably even bigger chip on his shoulder. Absolutely. I mean, if Boris knew a bit more about the culture and knew the difference between England and Scotland, he'd know all he had to do was wait an hour and then he'd win automatically because Renfrew would shit himself after all that booking. Oh, no. Big chop right there at the post. Renfrew not quite with it. He just thinks Boris is made of girders. Both men staggering around the ring. You are not going to see a catch as catch can specialist match here from two men who have drank the bar dry at North Wrestling. That is beer can. And if you see these guys coming, uh, help them up. Maybe get them into an Uber and send them home. Yeah, that's what friends are for. Chris Renfrew. Oh, not the bar. Back at the bar we go. I think you've had enough, mate. See, I, I, I'm a bath stuff trying to avoid eye contact. <laughs> As you would. And now they're arguing oh, over no. their order at the bar. Now, I'm a big fan of the bar staff here at the Riverside. I think that they work so hard on, on nights like North Wrestling Nights, and the prices are extreme, extremely competitive. Oh, oh, yeah, let's put them but, on. <laughs> To serve two people clearly intoxicated is, is yeah. pretty much against the code. Yeah, we should have we should have blown out the faces like a cop. <laughs> we don't want to get anybody sacked here. And that's oh, so what's that? Vodka, bookie, and beer. This is oh. bleak. This is a bleak affair. Two very drunk men competing in a sanctioned match at North Wrestling. No, Tom, this is good now. It's gonna be bleak tomorrow morning. <laughs> Boris Kozlov is certainly... Well, I wanted to say that Boris Kozlov is going to remember his first night at North Wrestling, but I don't think he will. I think he'll remember getting off at the A1. I think he'll remember getting into the Riverside, have a, a vague memory of standing across the ring from an Englishman, and then it's all a bit blurry. Yeah, we, asked, we actually asked Boris to do special guest comment during his own match, and he went, I wrestled for North? That's a problem, actually. Absolutely no record. Anyway, wrestling. Back in the it's ring like now. he was here. Renfrew back to his feet, staggering back. Oh, you, you do not want to kick a man in the stomach oh, after all that, Bucky. Oh, oh God. Oh, God. It went down. 
it will come up a very different colour. Probably a different texture too. No, no, this this is horrible. I think on the Queensbury rules, uh, kicks in the stomach are, are outlawed. We've got a three-way tag team match next. Are we going to have to take time to clean the ring? <laughs> yeah, we've got some other exciting wrestling matches next. Oh, oh no, no, no. Please, no. please, because oh, it's no. making me feel a bit gib. Oh. Please stop, please stop kneeing each other where all that beer is swirling around. These men like alcoholic washing machines staggering oh. around the ring. This is, this is, this is awful. And if you like this, well, the sport is every Saturday on ITV. I don't think this is what Mick McManus and, and... Oh no, oh no, oh no. This isn't what Mick McManus had in mind at all. I don't think you will see this on ITV1 on a Saturday night. I don't think this oh. is part of the schedule. Well, the one of the ratings are going down. Imagine this happening on something like X Factor. Imagine Simon oh, Cowell right. taking a shot. Stoner! He calls him the Stoner! What? Boris kicking out. He's used to the cold being from Russia. No, don't expect this on a Saturday night. Imagine Simon Cowell insisting on taking a shot every time oh, somebody no. hits a bomb note on the X Factor. Yeah. Spine buster by Boris Kozlov! And now just wailing down with punches. We have a wrestling move. We had two wrestling moves, no less. Brandon's going to pound him. Oh, Cossack dancing. Cossack leg drop. Leg drop. Communism and capitalism in one exciting move. Oh, not good enough, no. Just a two count. Renfrew managing to get that shoulder up. Both men in a bad way. They're in a bad way before the bell rang. Never, never mind red alert. Might be a white alert. Very soon, this match keeps on. Oh, out the and ring. Out. Oh, no, no, no spinning, through. Boris. That's a bad idea. Spinning might equal spillage. We've got oh. to be careful. Kozlov up top. Second rope. Misses with that Russian missile. Kozlov. Hopefully, that happens when the real war starts. Fingers crossed. Kozlov now staggering into the corner. Renfrew holding himself up on the ropes. Boris Yeltsin staggering around. Ooh! You try nailing a drop kick and then kip up after a bottle of Bucky and a bottle of vodka. He can't do that sober. Yeah, on the shoulders. Boris it's kick. like his spinach. On the second rope again. Missile! The Russian missile! And Kozlov's winding up. I tricked him. Arn Anderson style. Faked him out with a DDT. Red alert, red alert. Oh, Just a two close. count. Again, we have the statement the Kremlin denies any involvement with any agent, be it Boris or any people in London that happen to be at the same time. And now both men struggling with their bellies, wrestling. Imagine, I mean, it's, it's tough enough when you've been on a night out in Newcastle to walk through Big Market with a belly full of beer. Imagine oh. wrestling as well. Stoner! Nailed oh, it! Staggers him. Kozlov doesn't get down! He's putting on the Ritz. Stoner on the second rope! Oh, I may broke his neck. That'll do it! Time at the bar! They saw, they drank, they fought, Renfrew conquered. Yeah, Veni, Vidi, Vodka. Renfrew on top of the world. Yeah, hope and he doesn't fall off. Very much, I'm hoping he doesn't fall off. Massive win against the debuting Boris Kozlov in one of the darndest drinking contests I've ever seen. Chris Renfrew, oh, wait, barely oh, oh, able oh, oh. to get into the... Oh, hey! Well, I know we're all having an after party across the road. I think this was it. I, I don't know whether Renfrew's going to make it that far. I'll be very impressed if he does. Kozlov coming to his senses. This is like the hangover part four for Kozlov. Vaguely remembers starting a wrestling match. 
Boris has just woken up and being told the USSR isn't a thing anymore. Oh, Ren for extending the hand. Oh. Are we going to have Rocky IV? Oh, they're oh. all pals at the palace. Boris Kozlov and Chris Renfrew just battered each other senseless, drank together and are leaving together. We may have just seen the birth of the greatest tag team in North Wrestling history. That's right. The England and Ukraine connection. In all seriousness, though, the well done. Yes. Well, in all seriousness, though, well done for wrestling such an exciting match. Electro. Incredible scenes. I mean, we know some people and we've watched some matches where the guys couldn't do it sober. Not a North Wrestling, obviously. But to watch someone like, oh, hi there. Oh, How are you yeah. doing today? Yeah. Boris Kozlov and Chris Renfrew putting on a clinic uh, after several bottles of alcohol. 